Hey bro, I'm going to the store. Do you want me to get you apples or oranges? And you can't say both. Oh my god, I actually have to choose? Apples, oranges. Wait, did I do the laundry? Oh my god, I don't know what to choose. I, I like both. I like both. I like both though. Look alive, bro. I don't have all day. Which one is it? Uh, which one do you? You want. When the moon is in Libra, this gives one an altruistic and highly artistic soul. There is a very resounding power to the eloquent nature of one with their moon in this sign. And it definitely adds to the aesthetic that these people are receptive to and also receptive to expressing. And what I mean by that is no one more than the moon in Libra could have an eye out for style in a way that allows them to understand what the person who might be wearing a certain expression of clothes or style was going for. In fact, in that regard, a moon in Libra can tell a whole lot about a person just by the way they dress and the way they act. The energy of Libra brings with it this altruistic and classic energy, uh, whereas the moon in Aries is going to be more focused on themselves. The moon in Libra will be giving in a way that extends forth their ideas about other people. However, one thing that is very interesting about Moon in Libra and Moon in Aries are that these are two moons that allow these people to understand who other people are. The Moon in Aries is going to focus on their own soul expression and as they stand in place for other in themselves, they understand who others are based off that fire. The Moon in Libra, however, is going to reflect other people's energy back at them. There is very great balancing that occurs so that they could adjust the emotional experience of situations where whatever might be too much, they cut off any superfluous uh, communication or energy. And what's not enough, they definitely bring to the table. I think one of the best things about the moon in Libra is the telepathic gifts that it gives the natives. Remember, the moon is a very psychic energy. This isn't the sun in Libra that's going to be aware of very complex political and social situations or, you know, socio-political and even economic issues. The moon in Libra is going to tap into this at a very subtle level to where they may not even see what's going on, but they'll feel something off. In fact, what's even crazier is that moon, the moon in Libra allows one to feel into the politics of a situation where they don't even have to see what's going on. They'll just know. And once again, because Libra is a very mental energy with air, the moon will allow people to be receptive to other people's thoughts and it will allow them to direct their own thoughts in other people's minds, making very well for idea suggestion and even in some cases inception. Very important because once again, uh, given the very receptive nature of the moon, these people are going to be very keen to listen to the type of words you use and the general message of what you say. Moon and Libra individuals really like other people. This doesn't mean that they're a people person. They just like to balance themselves with other people so that there can really be experience of merging of opposites or more so just really examine how a lot of your ideas reflect uh, with theirs. One of the troubles of having a moon Libra though will come with mild indecision where it could be a bit tough to kind of know what exactly they feel.
feel like doing or want because they're going to really feel all sides of an issue. Uh, the problem is not really as bad as other legal placements, however, but they will still see this uh, in play. The mothering or nurturing influence of the moon in Libra was also probably very artistic, whereas if they had other siblings, their mother probably spoke to them a lot more or at least showed them more how to classically express themselves. This kid really bring with it an intellectualization of emotional problems or issues. And in some cases, the moon and Libra may not allow themselves to feel feelings because it's not logical. Jake, I heard how you feel. And you know, upon second thought, I really think you should hold off on sending that angry message. You're right. You shouldn't have been treated like that. I think that it's really dumb the way you were treated, but you're not really in the best mood right now. You don't want to say all those mean words. How about grab a cold beer, take a rest, and then see later if you still feel the same way, and then send it. If you do, do it. If not, just let it go, man. Yo, what's good, man? What do I want to have for breakfast? Uh, what do you want for breakfast? Oh, nice, nice. Okay. Oh, what do I want to wear? Uh, what do you want to wear? In conclusion, if your moon is in Libra, rest assured knowing that your soul is inherently artistic and you just know how to see the beauty in things. Not only do you this definitely allows you at a very profound level to see into who someone is and bring out their natural classic ability to really artistically express themselves. Because of you, a touch of beauty is added to everything.